Hey, do we have any pizza left? Hello everybody and welcome to the first episode of my ARK Survival Evolved Solo Ascension Mission on, you've guessed it, Scorched Earth. This is the second map that we've gone to after just completing the tech cave and the overseer fight. We are now running for our lives from every single thing possible. Now, this map is allegedly, I, I, no, you know, not allegedly. I would say this is the hardest map to start off in because literally everything's trying to kill you. The climate's trying to kill you. We spawned into an area where there is at least some water. But you see, like, we're going to get killed by this cap row here. We're going to, this episode will involve us just dying pretty much non-stop throughout this whole first episode. It's very hard to get a foothold in this. But we are starting it as a level 105. Alright, so we knocked him out, but we're going to die anyway here. I'm sure there's more stuff coming for us. So what we need to do at first here is get ourselves a foothold. We need to get to a point where we have a base to respawn at when we die. Uh, where we start getting some tranks and get our first tame going. Now, the goal for this series is to collect the dinosaurs that we want to to move on to the next map oh what's that oh, oh okay well you're running so i should probably run too uh yeah to get the dinosaurs we need to to get to the next map which we need to get ourselves some wyverns or wyverns uh one of each flavor uh is what we're gonna want let's see just try to get a lay for where we are okay a blue drop will be useful if we can survive we need to get ourselves some basic tools going, but we are starting off at level 105, so we will be able to craft anything we want. We don't have any engrams learned right now, uh, because we did the mine wipe tonic uh, when we were getting ready for the, uh, for the boss. I would like to be able to start off fresh right now with a fresh, uh, like fresh stat selections. Oh, yeah. Okay. Three wood should be enough. There. Maybe if I hide in this corner, things might leave me alone for a little bit longer. Mainly that guy right there. Alright, let's see what we can build. We'll make ourselves a pick to start, because we'll need that. Uh, we have 40 narco berries already, which is a good start. Uh, now we've got this, so we can do that and now with that we should have enough to make an axe how much no we need more thatch okay what's running and what do it's running that way okay so that should give me an opportunity to step out here grab some more of this as you can see this is a very brutal start and this is considered the midlands easy start area so this is uh, there's no like nice beach for us to start on that Everyone respects your distance. You can kill anything that doesn't attack you to get some hide. No, no, no. And as you can see, we're overheating. So this area gets hot very quickly. Some areas are hotter than others. Luckily, the area we're at now, it's kind of an oasis. There's some water at least. Uh, but this is not where we will be setting up our actual base. I would like to be setting up at Blue Obelisk in the uh, north part. Because that's where the Rexes are. Uh, that's where the good chance of getting a, a decent level UD and we'd be close to the wyvern trench so we want wyverns we obviously need rexes to beat the boss well, you can use a lot of things to beat the boss in this the boss is really not that difficult uh, and we need to beat the three caves to get the artifacts to go to the boss so that's kind of what we need to do uh, we did bring with us our uh, mutated rexes and we did bring with us our shotgun blueprint now, we won't be using the Rexes immediately. My plan for those is I will go around this and I'll play this map as if I don't have it. So I'll gather up some Rexes, uh, but I won't breed them. The breeding I'm going to do is for other species that we want. If we, if we want to get like Thylas bred up or something, we might do something fun like that. But we're not going to be breeding Rexes because I'm just going to use my already bred Rexes to make our army. But they won't be used until it's time to make that army. The shotgun, on the other hand, if I want to make it, I can. I just have to have the resources for it, which is really expensive. It's a lot of polymer. 
I've got a couple ideas on how to get some polymer. This map is not too hard to get it. But I digress. Our goal right now is... There we go. We can make ourselves an axe. Um, I would like to get some more wood going here. So I need to get some wood. And we need to find something to kill that would be able to give us some um, hide. That's going to be the next thing. So let's go around and grab a bit more thatch because I know I'm going to need some thatch to make my... Uh, uh, what's it, what, what do I need? Oh, arrows. That's what I need to dodge for. Arrows. Perfect. So I'm going to run up here. In a perfect world, I'm able to get to this blue drop. And in a perfect world, it's got a few items in it that will save me time. I'm also hoping there's a bit of water out here I can drink. So. Alright. Mad dash for this. Hopefully we can make it. I don't... Th I think we'll probably die attempting this, but it is most likely worth it. Maybe we can get some metal tools. I'm not sure. Let's see. You know what? A water... Yep, worth it. Water jar? Absolutely worth it. Because we need water. Actually, we don't have time to stop right out here. We can do this for now. Just eat some berries. Eat some berries, your problems will go away. For now. <laughs> Yo, we ate a lot of berries. Okay. Probably didn't need to do that. It's a bit overkill, but... We need to continue. So, I would like to get to the point where I can rush to metal tier. Uh, but I need to survive because there's no point in getting metal going if there's nowhere to store it. Right? Ah, right. Alright, so I need to find something I can kill. For, I need to make that. Okay, let's just drink this. Craft. Make that. And then all of those. Alright. Let's see. Cool. We've got our bow, and we're, we're going to craft up some arrows now. Um, I'm going to keep collecting berries as we walk along here. That is running from something, so something dangerous. Okay, I see a saber tooth down there. It's most likely that. Uh, here's a dodic. I don't think I have enough to actually kill a dodic right now, because when they turtle up, they, they become like pretty much unkillable. Oh, here's that... Uh, Okay, yeah, I'll kill this guy. That'd be perfect. There we go. I for I completely forgot about this Capro. Thank you so much, Capro. I appreciate that. Because now with this Capro, and if I can just gather a bit of wood and get back up there, I should be able to get to the point where I can be safe? Question mark? Maybe? We'll see. See how much resources I can gather on my way up there. If I can make a little hut... That'd be great, and by up there, I mean just up on this little section that we were already at. Hopefully we can get there, put a little hut down, get a bed. And if we have a bed, then it's pretty easy. We can just start leaving gear there, run around. If we die, we die. It's not the worst thing in the world. Okay, let's keep gathering this. We're going to need some stone. Oh, the stress is starting off fresh on an arc, but you know what? That's all the fun of it, too. Like, these these moments are the most exciting, the most fun I find that I get uh, in the series is the first. Like, once you're already pretty powerful, it's not... You need one of those. I need more thatch. Is it worth running out to get more thatch? Maybe I can get some more up here. Okay. There we go. Is there more thatch to be had up here? Oh, probably not. Must have got like way up there, but I don't find a way up there easily. Okay, well, hmm. Now I've got a problem. I need to get up to get some more thatch to make a bed. But I could probably just get away with a sleeping bag, but then it's only one use and I'm wasting hide. Oh, the decisions sometimes you have to make when you're doing this. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna do this. We're gonna craft one of those one of those one of those yeah let's do that we'll get a, a, a little spot at least started up here should be kind of safe for now nothing we do is going to be overly safe but that's the nature of starting off fresh so put that there completely unnecessary but 
I'll keep all my extra stuff in there that I don't necessarily need right away. Store that. I'm going to put this down. Hopefully a little bit far away from my, my gear in case I do get jumped or killed. Uh, it might give me a few seconds to lure it away. Put that down here. And let's check on the meat. Meat's not ready to spoil yet, but I will put my 96 narco berries in there. Store the rest of those. Get rid of that. Drop that. Drop that. Store this. Store this. Store this. Store. And actually, I should be able to make clay. No, I need some cactus sap. So we're not quite at that point yet. We're gonna put that here. Boom, 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 boom. Put all this stuff away for now. Honestly, we'll probably put that there because we're gonna have a high likelihood of dying. But we need to run out here. We need to get some more resources, some more thatch. Mm. Oh, oh, okay. Depending how this fight goes, we might join in and help out. The Dodic. We'll have to we'll have to keep an eye out on on what's going on over there. Uh, I do need to gather up my more resources. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the video here. Um, actually, you know what? No, let's let's keep this going a little bit longer. Because uh, I have a f I have a gut feeling something exciting is gonna happen that I'm not gonna be a fan of. But we're gonna need to keep it. You guys might like to watch. So I don't like that tail that's sticking out there. At all. Let's see. What's in these? Oh, just a normal bush. Okay. Uh, we do need to get some... Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Are we able to derp it on that rock long enough to get out of aggro range? We're going to find out in a second here. If it caught up to us. I think we're able to get away. But now we have one saber tooth. Oh no, it's still chasing us. Sweet. What level are you? Yeah, no, we are very dead. Okay, well, maybe we're able to lure it away. Yeah, we're dead. And there's a lot of bad things around there. <laughs> Oh, that is part of starting off. But we're able to go to our sleeping bed. Sleeping bag, and hopefully not all is lost. So what I'm going to do at first here, immediately craft another one. And we're going to throw it down. Also, look at our alpha implant. We get 10 more levels, yeah. Oh, look at that. Boom, put it down. There we go. And now we're back up here. So let's see, what can we craft? We're going to need one of these. We need thatch. Okay, well, we're at the point now where we can't really do much. No, we're going to take this split stack. No, we're going to put it in here. And then we're going to split stack. Uh, oh, no, we can't do it in there. Okay, well, we'll just do it in our inventory. Split all. Boom. We're going to let that spoil up. We're just going to gather up a bunch more berries. I think that's the smart thing to do. We're going to gather up a bunch of berries, make a bunch of narcotics. We have enough to do that. And, uh, yeah. So I'm going to get these berries all gathered up here. Uh, get the narcotics going, make another bow, probably kill that dude with a bow. Um, but yeah, that's going to be enough for today's episode. You know what? I'm going to try to keep this series to about the 15 minute mark. I find that's uh, that's what you guys seem to like the most. That's what's getting the most views is somewhere in that range. And keeps people from getting bored and missing out on some of my content. So thank you guys so much for watching. This is my first episode of my Arc Solo Ascension series on Scorched Earth. If you like the video, like the series, hit a like button, drop a comment, subscribe, do all the things. And I will see you guys next time.